Hello, my name is Kara, and today I will be showing you all how to draw a cat. We are going to be using a pencil to do guidelines, and then a pen to do the final drawing. So you're going to start off with drawing a circle. Try to draw lightly so that you can erase it later. It doesn't have to be perfect. As you can see, I'm not really, I didn't draw the circle perfectly in one go because you are going to be erasing it. So just draw something lightly that you can use to help you figure out where everything is going to be placed. Then you're going to cut the circle in half and you're going to cut it in half the other way. After you cut it in half, you're going to go into this bottom quadrant and you're going to cut that in half. And you're going to see the horizontal line and you're going to cut it in two fourths. So you're going to cut it in half again on each side. So this will be where the eyes are going to be placed. And down here is where you're going to place the nose. Then you're going to go and you can add ears. You can make them as big or as small as you want. And that is just triangles that rest on the circle. And you can add a half circle for the cat's body. Alrighty, that is all of the guidelines. And remember, this is just to help you figure out where you are going to be placing things. So from here on, from what you've done doesn't necessarily need to be perfect. And now we are going to be using pen. And this is where you want to be a little bit more careful when drawing. Uh, you're going to draw a circle around the lines of the eyes that you made. And then you can add another circle inside. If you mess up, like I did, you can just make the circle a little thicker. And then just make sure whatever you do to one eye, you also do to the other eye. And then you can color in the pupils. All right, then you're going to add the nose. So first you have to do the muzzle because the cat's face does protrude out a little bit. You're going to draw a circle around the line that you made for the nose. It should be a little bigger on the bottom. At the actual line that you made for the nose, you're going to add a triangle. And you can color that in or you can leave it blank. Then you are going to add a half circle and another half circle for the mouth. You add some dots outside the circle and some lines for the whiskers. All right, so if you want a fluffy cat, then you can add little poofs, which are just going to be bended triangles. If you don't want a fluffy cat, you can just draw around the circle. Uh, I'm going to add some little poofs onto the sides because I want a very fluffy cat. And then for the bottom of the face, you are just going to draw over the circle that you made for the guidelines. Now the ears, you just have to draw over the guidelines you made before. And then find where the guideline for the circle is. And there you're going to add a half circle and another half circle. And then a larger half circle. And that is going to be for the insides of the ears. Then you are going to go over the guidelines you made for the body. And if you want, you can add a little squiggle for the fur. After that, you can just add little decorations. I'm going to give my cat a little bow. It's just a circle and another circle. And then little squares on the circle or squares. You can make it either one. And then I'm going to color the bow in.
You can also give the cat a tail. You just do a squiggle, and then you just replicate the squiggle. You can add a collar. Oh, and then, of course, you just have to erase the guidelines. Once the guidelines are completely erased, you have finished your cat. Thank you for watching. This was how you draw a cat.